Hey guys, and welcome back to another Sims 3 current household video. And uh, this is my current household. We're going to look at him in just a minute here. Uh, let's go ahead and zoom in just a little bit so we can see him. This is my this is my current household. This sim is named Gentian Moore. And as you can see, he is a plant sim. So look at that. We we're actually playing with the plant sim. And you guys might have seen him before if you have followed Lenora's Bachelorette Challenge. He was actually one of the contestants, but was eliminated kind of sort of mid to late competition. But um, anyway, so um, the lady who had passed him to me now, I had I had asked her if I could uh, continue to use him after the challenge uh, because I had something special that I wanted to do with him. I don't know exactly what that is, but I kind of will know it when... I see it, I guess, and I kind of got a little inkling, but at the time, like, you know, I, I still wanted to just, you know, I liked him, and so I wanted to uh, use him later on down the line for, uh, you know, perhaps one of my stories or something. So anyway, um, Gentian was one of the contestants in Lenora's Bachelorette Challenge, and I am using him, and he is also a part of the Pen Pal Project that, um, I think I was talking about that in uh, one of my previous videos. It's on the Sims forums. And so basically you, you take a your Sim and then somebody else takes a Sim and uh, your Sims write pen pal letters back and forth to each other. So it's pretty cool. It kind of gives you a little more um, of a different avenue as far as getting to know your characters and getting to know somebody else's characters. So anyway, um, now when Gentian came to Lenora's Bachelorette Challenge, I didn't really have any kind of family history for him. Like she didn't provide me with much of anything. The only thing I really knew about him was that he was part of her Adam and Eve challenge and he had since died, I guess, in that challenge. I think he got, <laughs> I think he, he poor Gentian, I think he got, um, eaten by the cow plant or something in her game. So um, Jenshin was like no longer there, but she had him up on her page and she submitted him for the, the challenge. So anyway, um, what I did was I, I took him um, and I I just kind of, for my own gameplay sake and stuff, I, I uh, changed up the traits a little bit. Like he has slightly different traits. Um, he's good. He's a bookworm. He's athletic, good sense of humor and handy. Um, now, I think he had the green thumb trait and some other trait, but I think plant sims already come with green thumbs, so that was kind of a wasted trait, I think. So anyway, um, he is a young adult. I have actually frozen his age because I like him so much that I'm going to keep him around for a very, very long time. So he actually has frozen age, which let me go ahead and show you. Um, come on, come on. So Genshin is never going to age up because that's just the way it is. His favorite music is Roots. He likes <laughs> grilled cheese. Not that plant sims can really eat any kind of um, food. I mean, they can, but they don't get any nourishment from it. And then his favorite color is Aqua. Um, so anyway, um, as you can see, he is a plant sim. So we don't have any uh, hunger or bladder or, yeah, no hunger, no bladder, but we've got everything else. So let me just show you the house that he is in now. I placed him in a custom world card called Darthtopia. And I'm not really sure how I feel about this world. Um, I've got a lot of custom worlds that I haven't really played in as of yet. So I'm kind of, I like to use them to kind of test uh, some different things out and stuff. But um, I need to populate this world because it does not come <laughs> with any Sims. So um, I have, uh, now as you can see, because Genshin is just kind of one of my, just kind of, one of my Sims who was just there, um, he's lived a long time, so he's amassed quite a uh, quite a sizable fortune. Uh, so, you know, that's why he's got quite a bit of money. We don't really have to worry about any kind of money for him. But let me just show you the house that he actually lives in, and then um, we will go ahead and get uh, some gameplay in. So we have this two-car garage, and I got him uh, these... This house already came with some cars, but I got rid of them because they were kind of cheap. And I have some custom cars from like uh, Fresh Prince Creations and a couple of other places. So um, we've got some really nice cars for him. Uh, let me just go ahead and show you just around the house a little bit. Now here is a room with uh, with the washer and dryer and stuff. And then um, the bathroom right there. So it's the bathroom and all that kind of comes right in through there. Um, we have over here the... Um, 
let me let me try to put the walls up so that we can we can see just a little bit here there's a bathroom right there uh, we've got another um, cabinets and stuff out there in the and we got the washer and dryer kind of out there in the in the garage which is a nice place for it so um, over here is the hamper we got a bookcase and stuff we got uh, uh, a dresser and everything there uh, we've got over here here is a, a nice living room right there with it looks like oh come on I can't get it to turn Ugh. cannot get it to turn um, actually here is a a nice bedroom right there and not the living room but the bedroom um, very very nice we have living room with the fireplace over here and we have now this is one of the houses that came with this world so I didn't really do much with it just kind of put maybe just a few other things in it that it didn't have here's a nice little study area with um, with some bookshelves and stuff right here we have a really nice kitchen not that he is really gonna need too much of a kitchen since he is a plant sim and he doesn't really he doesn't really eat but I think I'm gonna put in um, I think I'm gonna try to put in the canning station because we do have quite a bit of room out here to do a garden and he can mess with that a little bit and then we got over here kind of an entertainment room well dining room with the with the bar in there with the buffet table this stuff already came with the house and I, di I didn't take any of this out oops now up here uh, we've got uh, some bedrooms and stuff so it does come with like um, it does come with a nursery so in case he you know gets married and has a little plant sim baby we got a, a child's room we got um, you know, we just got some other bedrooms and stuff up here. So there's another nice bedroom there. Um, we've also got um, a basement. Now over here in this area, I have made a little area to put in a little garden. So if he wants to grow some vegetables and stuff and practice his little plant sim stuff in his garden. Now over here in his basement, this is his little play area. <laughs> He's definitely got a little play area. Now this basement came with this house, but I have since kind of done a little bit uh more with it actually you know what this house did not come with this world i think it was in in my bin i think i was gonna use it for a kidnap challenge or something yeah that's right um this house did not come with the with the town um this house is actually in my bin uh from the uh kidnap challenge that i was gonna use so over here we've got uh um we had like another little kitchen area over here because like this is where the kidnap people were gonna stay and cook and stuff and we got another little dining area down here i might do something with that but i've not decided um because i'm not really using in this game anyway i'm not using the house for this purpose i've kept the original one obviously so in case i want to do a kidnap challenge or something i can now over here we've got um you know just some skilling things we got uh we got uh i put in the the toy maker uh, because i haven't played with that in a while we have sculpting we have science we got potions we got um nectar maker because we can grow some things and make uh, make some make some wine we got a nice little sitting area over here some painting so they can kind of relax and so forth and then over here is is uh, I got some nectar racks and stuff to put that stuff in. So that is Genshin's house. Um, it's it's uh, quite a big house for one sim, but hopefully he will meet a nice plant sim lady and they can you know they can um, really enjoy um, enjoy that uh, together as a family because we have plenty of room for that. So anyway, now Genshin, um, as you can see, he is practicing over here on his martial arts. He is. Um, uh, I do have a little exercise room over here for him because um, he, his lifetime wish is perfect mind, perfect body. So we've got the treadmill, we've got a power burn station, uh, martial arts, and then we got a gyroscope conductor over here. So uh, he has plenty of stuff to build up his athletic skill. We've also got the, the chin up bars and stuff. So he's got plenty of stuff to build up his athletic skill. So what we're going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and get into some gifts and we will... Um, we're going to go ahead and, and look at some gifts and um, see if anybody sent us anything and then we'll get into some gameplay. See if I have any pending friends. I don't think I do. Nope. 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 All right. So let's go ahead and see what we have for some gifts. We have quite a few, it looks like. 
All right, so from Carol the Pirate. Uh, hope you are still enjoying The Sims 3. Oh, yes. Man, I haven't seen you in, in like, forever, forever, forever. So it's great to see you still around, Carol. Um, and we got a xylophone, so I think maybe that gift is trying to tell us a little something. <laughs> so we are definitely going to send something back to you because, um, you know, simply because we haven't seen you in ages and ages and ages. I'm going to say, well, hey, stranger. Yep, still enjoying Sims 3. Ah. Still, I can't type. My nails are getting a little bit long. Hope you are too. Um, we got a xylophone. And here's something for, for your Sims. All right. Yeah, I can't type with my nails. They're starting to get a little bit long. I'm going to have to go do something with them in a little bit. Okay, so from uh, Sasusika Forevs, and we're getting a surprise gift box. And it looks like we have a sunflower vase, so we're going to we're going to send you something back. You get we're going to go ahead and send you oh a surprise gift box. Uh, we're going to say thank you for all the gifts you've been sending. Uh, hope this is useful for your sims and joy okay all right okay from the same person i'm not even going to attempt to try to pronounce that again and this time we're getting some money. We have 3,500 simoleons, and we've already sent you one, so we're going to spread that wealth a little bit. So from uh, Mar Mira Gaming, and we're getting a care package. And it looks like we have some bubble bath. All right. Jinjin, there you go. <laughs> How about we do a surprise gift box for you? Um, thanks for the bubble bath for my current household um hope you get something great for your sims enjoy okay good deal from uh niena 86 and we're getting a uh, surprise gift box and it looks like we have a telescope all right so we're going to send you the surprise gift box. We will say thanks for the telescope for my current household. Hope you get something great for your Sims. Enjoy. Yeah, honestly, I don't know how people can, can do it with like super, super long nails. I never could. <laughs> Another one from the Sasusa Sasaka Forever. Sorry, I can I cannot say your name. <laughs> and it looks like we have the Sun Disc. Um, I totally butcher your name. I am so sorry about that. Um, another one from the same person. And of course, we've sent them a gift, so we're going to spread that wealth. We have a guitar for Genshin. Thank you so much. Another one from Carol the Pirate with a surprise gift box. And we have a global sculpture. Globe sculpture. Um, and we've sent uh, something back, so we're going to spread that wealth just a little bit. From the game, 24561, and we're getting a care package. So we have a, a sketchbook, so we're going to send something back. Surprise gift box for you. Thanks for the sketchbook. For my current household, hope you get something great for your Sims. Enjoy. Okay. Uh, from December Dreams, we are getting a care package. And it looks like we have the sketchbook and an easel. 
and I cannot send any more. I've gotten through my five. I apologize. I always say this in my videos. I wish I could send more. I totally do. From Vicki Pratt says, we'll be checking out your story. Hope, uh, hope the hope this at hope this finds aids you well. All right, and it's a surprise gift box. So it looks like we have the prima the perma palm. So thank you so much, Vicki. Um, a Tawana 16, and we're getting a surprise gift box. And we're getting some 500 simoleons. And from the Miami girl, hope you are enjoying your Sims. I know I am. <laughs> All right, so we are getting a surprise uh, gift box and we have a bed, so thank you so much. I will have to send you something back when I can. So I'm gonna go ahead and stop here for just a minute, save the game, and then we'll come back with some gameplay. Okay guys, so here we are. We're gonna go ahead and do our little gameplay. We've got uh, Genshin on his little uh, training dummy. Yeah. So we're looking to get some martial arts up for him right now. Um, um, now, as I said, for him, I, I did not get any much of a family history or anything from the lady who passed him over to me. Um, he was in, I believe, her Adam and Eve challenge. So I've had to kind of come up with, with my own thing here. Um, now, he did not, obviously he did not win Lenora's um, bachelorette challenge because, you know, she's with someone else. Um, but, uh, in my story, you know, I have them still remaining very good friends because, oh, we have the university mascot guy. Um, I just pretty much just opened this, uh, game not very long ago at all. Like, I've not been playing this for very, very long at all. But anyway, he, um, uh, so I've had to, oh, here's our time portal. <laughs> so we're getting everything. We are getting everything here. As I said, I, I just opened this game up uh, a couple of days ago uh, for just a very, very brief, 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 brief um, something to just get a couple of profile, uh, not profile, um, but for the uh, pen pal project that that I have him in. So anyways, I was saying, you know, um, he did not win Lenora's challenge because she was with someone else. But in my story, I have them still being good friends. And because a lot of time has elapsed in Lenora's story, I mean, we're on generation two with um, Lenora's kids grown up. So if um, Genshin were to like age normally, he yeah. would um, have probably yeah. either been an elder or have died, but I've frozen his age. And in my story, I've written a reason for that. Like I've written, I've written um, accordingly. Um, so uh, he's got martial arts skill. Um, and it was in in the story that I have for him, like his details. Now, this is not what the original creator of him had, and he was actually like picked, yeah. you know, in her game. But um, so I I've had him kind of like being a scientist and and um, you know doing experiments to to um, like he was yeah. interested in the aging process and and how um, different things would react to his body chemistry, you know, being what he is. So because of like yeah. a lot of the, the experiments that he did Ooh. was on himself. Um, so it slowed down his aging uh, to pretty much a crawl. So hence the um, age freeze potion. So he's going to like be around for a very, very long time. Yeah. So in my uh. head, <laughs> which, um, which he's going to be explaining in, in his letters in the pen pal project, he, um, uh, hi, the lady who picked him, um, Evelyn, um, this, this was just, uh, you know, somebody, um, off the top of my head here. I don't have an Evelyn. I don't, I haven't created her, but, um, Evelyn, um, wasn't it was unable to have a, a child oh goodness evelyn was un unable to have a child with with her husband her husband had since passed um and uh oh show that new belt her husband had since passed but she you know so she was real lonely like um you know she had nobody so she wished uh, for a good fairy to uh, she she wished like for a, a child um and uh now in the game you can't really do this like you can't wish and then have a, a good fairy come and bring you a child you have to do that with the wishing well it's got martial arts to level two but you know i mean i can do anything yeah. i want in my own stories right <laughs> so um anyway she wished for a child and a good fairy came to visit her and, and yeah. gave her this little seed to plant and so hence came gentian so um that is how i have him for my story um you know for my purposes yeah. so um 
Anyway, this gal that I got him from is very generous with sharing her Sims, so um, I'm really grateful for that. Um, she had quite an array of Sims up on her page. Um, hopefully she still does. If I can find the original link for Genshin, I will put that in the description section of the video. So if those of you that still play Sims 3, if you want him, if you want to plant Sim, you can uh, download him if I can find him. So yeah. Um, yes, yes, yes. Oh, Genshin, you're going to need your water. Cause I guess when you're when he's doing his little martial arts, he gets um, he's going to get uh, sweaty. <laughs> so he loses his moisture. We got mixologists in our little town. So very nifty. So let me just go over the things that he wants to do. He wants to learn sculpting skill. He wants to discover a potion. He wants to learn science skill. And then we've also got, um, I don't know if I want to do university right now with him. Learn the athletic skill, which we will do. Uh, travel to the future. We'll do that at some point, I think. Befriend a werewolf. <laughs> I really need to populate my town because I don't really have um, anything. Redeem festival tickets. I really don't have anything um, in my town right now. Um, this is a custom world and it comes unpopulated. So, I mean, Sims will spawn, but I do need to get in and, uh, I really do need to get in and, uh, um, put some people in. Uh, the gift of giving. Nicely decorated. Fulfilled. Okay, Genshin, you're gonna need your, your water here pretty quickly. So... Uh, we will take care of that yeah. because you're starting to get very, uh, yeah. very, uh, what do we got here? Uh, we're starting to get very, um, an, an, um, what am I saying? Um, we're starting to get very dry. <laughs> We are going to be very dry here, so we're gonna we're gonna send him over to, um, and I think they can just do that with the with the shower. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and get your shower after you're done there, Genshin, and that will get your that will get your uh, that will get your water need done. Okay, through tireless training. Your tireless training and he's got a belt so we're gonna get him into the there to get his water need taken care of and there we go that helps that helps a lot so um, now um, he wanted to go ahead and do some some things here so we're gonna we're gonna put him onto the the tab cast and we're gonna get him to we're gonna go ahead and listen to some science He's going to listen to some science while he uh, comes down to the basement to work on, let's see, what do we want to have him work on? Ah, come down to the basement where you can go ahead and work on some, he wants to, he wants to discover a potion. So let's go ahead and just let him go ahead and do that. Come on over here. Oh, come on. Get over here and discover this potion. I was clicking on the lights, I guess. I couldn't get it to couldn't get it to go. So we're gonna send him onto the we're gonna send him onto the multi tab and I, I love the little flowers that, that go behind him when they walk. Um, it's so cool. So I am gonna get in here and I am gonna populate this town. So it takes him a little bit to get downstairs. I should put in some tube elevators. I really should, but that's okay. That is fine. So we got our science skill. Um, visit a graveyard during a full moon. Oh my goodness. Learn the inventing skill. Read a book about martial arts. I don't have one in the bookshelf because we haven't been to China. 
Um, I got the martial arts stuff through the bide to bug. <laughs> okay, as a scientist, okay, so he can he can do that. Ah. So he's going to start to get, um, now we, I do have him in the military career. Um, in his letter, like in the pen pal project, he um, mm -hmm. said that he was kind of, had the luxury of kind of um, going in between jobs and stuff right now because, you know, he's made a lot of money, so he doesn't really need to, to work at the moment. Mm -hmm. But um, I, I did go ahead and put him in the military career. And we're going to, I'm going to try to get some screenshots. Ah. Um so that we can, um, so that I can get, um, um, you know, for his, like, uh, pen pal letters and stuff. Um, I like to get his screenshots to be able to, uh, take care of that. Come on, come on, come on. So, I'm going to just kind of zero in on him for just a, a little bit to get, you know, some different uh, screenshots of him doing these different things. Um, that way he's got, uh, mm -hmm. that way he's got uh, uh. stuff for his letters. Mm. Or for, yeah, because he's uh. got like two, he's got like two letters that he has to write. He writes to a girl named Emily, and then he's also going to write to a guy named uh, Caleb. So um, I have to get screenshots to go with those letters and stuff. So, yep. I really like Jenshin. I um, hmm? I liked him when, when she submitted mm -hmm. him. I mean, I, I like Plant Sims. I think yeah. Plant Sims just kind of make everything better, you know. <laughs> they do. Yeah. So he has got some logic under his belt now. Who um is he? So, uh, yeah, he, um, what was I saying? He, um, I, I just, I, I just really liked him. I, I really did. So, um, I wanted to be able to, uh, have him to, to, to use, um, for some, you know, for a very special purpose. What that purpose is, I kind of got an inkling, as I said, but I, um, I kind of got an inkling right now, but, you know, it's still kind of up in the air. I've not decided fully what I want to do just yet. So I'm going to try to just get uh, some some screenshots of him just doing these different things. Yeah. So what I'm going to do in this session of gameplay with him is just get some skills mm -hmm. under his belt a little bit. Ah. And I will be working on this town just a little bit to populate it, as well as put some other things down, some buildings down that I might want to use. Mm -hmm. I think I might have to put a festival grounds in because mm -hmm. I don't think it came with a festival grounds for seasons. Ah, but that's okay. We can we can put one in. So let's hope he discovers something the vessel it's almost at level two with logic Custom. which is good uh. Uh -huh. oh, there we go he is at level two with logic uh -huh. so uh -huh. that uh. definitely helps all right Jenshin, let's see if you can discover something unroutable sim found uh -huh. Wayne. Okay, we got. I guess what they do is they they take um. When Sims generate like in the town or whatever, like it must take some stuff from the bin and just put some some people down. So, that was uh, Wayne, <laughs> which has also appeared in one of my stories. He is Carson's brother. Carson is the one that's going to be marrying Ella, who is my fairy queen. Yes. So there is a rhyme and a reason <laughs> to a lot of the Sims that I have in my bin. And, you know, I mean, I just, I like creating Sims, too. I, I really do. I like creating Sims. So, Although my create a Sim, my cast, man, it takes a really, really long time to load. 
because I have a lot mm -hmm. of content. I have uh -huh. I have a lot of uh, CC and stuff, ah. hair, hair and clothes and stuff. Jenshin, hmm. mm -hmm. I hope you don't blow oh. your. Oh, <coughs> oh, that that scared the crap out of me. Holy crap! Oh my gosh, that scared the crap out of me. Holy crap! Like I saw the sparks, I was like, "Whoa!" That scared me to death. Ah! Oh, that scared the crap out of me. Now I don't know if I have any. I forgot if I put a shower down here. I think I did, because I know with this inventing table they can, and sometimes do catch on fire. <laughs> so I do have this all in one bathroom over here that we can put him in. Use all in one bathroom, Jenshin. Holy oh. crap! I had a feeling that was going to happen, but boy, like it just, it really just kind of hit me like right in the face. That scared the crap out of me. Oh my gosh, like that scared the crap out of me. Holy crap. Listen to some science. Uh, you wanted to learn sculpting. Actually, the energy level is going to be down in just a little bit, but let's go ahead and and um, we'll practice with uh we'll practice with some clay so he wanted to learn that sculpting skill so we will we will do that and then i can get some pictures for him with that oh no he wanted to learn and oh no he wants to learn inventing and sculpting so we will we will do that but we're gonna go ahead and get some pictures of him doing doing this stuff like, I had a feeling that that thing was going to blow up because, like, the, the skill bar on his thing disappeared, like, over his head. It disappeared. And, uh, it disappeared. Uh, it scared the crap out of me, though. Oh, my gosh. Like, I saw the sparks and, oh. So, we're going to go ahead and get, uh, we're going to get, uh, some... We're going to go ahead and get pictures of, of him doing some of this stuff here. So just bear with me while I just kind of stop the game every now and again to get this, to get what I need. Uh, trying to get there. Maybe, maybe if I do it this way. Yeah, I think that'll work a little better. Okay. All right. So I want to get that science thing up because I want to get where he can clone like different plants and stuff. He's got science to level two. I want to get where he can do some uh, cloning and stuff on the different plants and make his like forbidden oh forbidden fruit seeds without um, woohooing with anybody. <laughs> he was able to, he is able to for science. I've not played with the science station in a long time. Um, research and sell scientific samples um look at the inventory okay so we'll have to actually get onto the science station at some point and then water but yeah we're gonna have to get him to because he's gonna his energy level is gonna drop so we're gonna have to get him to uh he's fatigued we're gonna have to get him to uh go to bed or something photosynthesize or something like that. He's hydrated. So many sims pay close attention to uh, nutrition, um, sleep, and exercise. Uh, Genshin has his priorities straight. Um, hydration, it, hy hydration is um, paramount. So that gives him a plus 30, 30 in mood. He's fatil f f f fatilled, <laughs> fulfilled. Okay, so he's got a sculpting skill under his belt. Research science. He wants a chess table. I would like us to do that. Although I thought I had a chess table for him, but we'll have to see. So, nine, 
about 9.30. We're gonna, we're probably gonna send him off to bed. Or something, come on. Or something because uh, he is really starting to get kind of tired. Come on. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Clean house, you can do that. I'll wait till he, till he gets a tired mood, but fatigued, having a blast, hydrated, nicely decorated, and fulfilled. So he is doing pretty well. Now, I believe he has to get to work. Come on, come on, come on. Oh my gosh, come on, I'm frozen. <sighs> okay guys, give me a minute. Ah. All right guys, I don't know what the heck happened, but yeah, um, so he does need an athletic skill. He's gotta go to work. He doesn't have to, he, he has to go to work at uh, seven in the morning <laughs> so we are gonna have to get him to uh we could now i do have a come on i think i do have some elixirs in here for him i think i do have elixirs in here for him to to take <sighs> boy i'm getting all kinds of lag here like this is crazy And this is a new game too. Like this is a new game and it's it's lagging on me just horribly, horribly. But I think I do have elixirs in here for him. Yes, I do. Um, we have potent friendship ones. Potent invigorating elixirs. So we're going to just go ahead and potently invigorate him. Um, now, obviously with his age frozen and with death flowers and stuff, I, I had, uh, like for these particular games that, that I... I have a, um, oh, come on. Okay, so as I was saying, like for these games where I pretty much have like um, Sims, uh, you know, where I pretty much have Sims where they're gonna be immortal and stuff, we're gonna sell this thing. Um, we're gonna we're gonna sell it, um, sell for 52. Um, I have a, a couple of delivery Sims that drop off a bunch of death flowers and elixirs and stuff that, that really helps. So, um, he is okay so it just says that he did a clay chair um so he is going to be potently invigorated and he is at level two with the with the uh uh sculpting uh, mommy, nah. okay so we're going to go ahead and send him or put him back onto the multi-tab we're gonna see we're gonna try to get like a bunch of these like skills under his belt here um we're going to go ahead and listen to come on we're gonna go ahead i really want him to get some gardening under his belt i really do and so we're gonna do that come on Ugh. And then I want to go ahead and have him uh, research his, uh, his science. So come on, research science. Um, we're going to uh, we'll do a horticulture experiment. Um, improve his science skill. So we 
are doing pretty well. Having a blast. Hydrated. Nicely decorated. Fulfilled. Potently invigorated. Listening to Tabcast. So we could have him do something with his athletic skill too as soon as he is done with, with this. Because he's going to have to get to work. Anything worth doing. So he's got a, a gardening under his belt, which is good. So he will be able to plant some things. And when he harvests, it will increase his skill. So... Alright, so we're going to go ahead and... Oh, he's going to get some nerd influence here. So we're going to... I'm going to get a screenshot of him doing this. It's giving him that, that nerd influence. So we will just kind of show him in concentration. Because this gives me some good stuff to, to have for his, uh, ooh, for his uh, pen pal letters. Get back over here. He's almost done doing the research. Alright, so he's he's getting some nerd influence. He's becoming a nerd. Or he will become a nerd. But that's okay because as per his little, you know, profile, um, you know, that he was a scientist and stuff, he um let's go with a lettuce seed as per his little uh what do you call it um profile that i had you know it would fit him because um he was a scientist and he has been so we're gonna go ahead and um get a picture of him doing this ah i keep getting that beam in the way and it's going to drive me bonkers Okay. Okay. Uh. All right. Okay, so we're going to, as soon as he is done with this, come on, we're going to put him back onto the multi-tab to do some science. Eh, I don't think it worked. Um, horticulture failure. And I think he lost his seed, but that's okay. It wasn't one of the it wasn't one of the real popular seeds. So we're gonna come back up here to his exercise room and we're gonna we're going to get on to our uh, treadmill. Um, we'll get onto our treadmill or something and have him do a little bit of workout uh, before he has to get to work. Jenshin, you're gonna go ahead and work out. Okay. And then we'll just have him to not break a sweat.
He should have some time to be able to do his workout before he has to go to work. Alright. Nope. Oh, he's got science again. So we're going to try to tell him to not break a sweat. If we can. Oh my gosh. I guess we gotta wait till we get some skill though. <laughs> we gotta get a little bit of skill. Uh, okay, so he did get some athletic. Um, he's athletic. He's got science to level three, so we're gonna go ahead and don't break a sweat. Don't break a sweat. Um, so he can he realizes the world isn't square. Analytics, uh, Okay, so he can analyze gems and, and metals. Ah! Oh. See what the world is made oh. of. Um, okay, so check his inventory. So they, they've given him some stuff to work on. Whoa! Oh. Come on, come oh. on, come on. Oh. Gosh. Okay, so I'm gonna... We're going to get him to, uh, I'm going to take a little picture of him working, working oh. out. <laughs> Not falling, but uh, actually working oh. out here, Genshin. <laughs> All right. So let's do that for you. Okay, athletic skill to level two. He's getting it up there pretty quick, I gotta say. Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. But you gotta quit falling, my friend. So his athletic ah! is excellent now, which he will oh. get uh, oh. good before he has to go to work. Analyze a rock. Let's see what else we have in here for him. Here's our scientific sample. Uh, improve sculpting skill. Let's see what else that we can keep for him. Keep these slots open for him and see what else he gets. So I have an inkling of what I do want to do with him. Um, as far as, uh, as far as, like, what's going to happen in my stories, but, um, I'm not quite sure. It's not set in stone. I haven't totally decided, but I will. I will. So, I'm going to go ahead and get... As soon as you quit falling, my friend. As soon as you quit falling. My goodness. So we're going to just grab that. Again. Whoa! I'm trying to get some oh. screenshots so I can do his letters. Okay, the carpool. Come on, come on. You know what? We're going to get you your raise. So we're going to send you to work. And you're going to go ahead and... Let's have you just work hard today. And he's got workout for four hours straight. Go jogging. Could do that. Um, improve athletic skill. Um, I think I'll take off the inventing. And then we'll just uh, do the athletics. All right, guys, so I'm going to go ahead and let him go to work. I will come back after he is done, and we'll do some more gameplay. Okay, guys, so we're back. Uh, he is back home. He got 280 simoleons today. We're going to listen to to some more science on the multi-tab. And then he got an opportunity to read a book uh, for his work to get him some more work performance and stuff. So we're going to go ahead and do that. We're going to let him do that. 
and he is in his little military fatigues. <laughs> and then he wanted to go jogging and stuff, so he's he needs his fun level is coming up, which is good, and that helps. Um, being a bookworm helps. And there is a sale going on at the bookstore, so I think I may buy him some books. We shall see. Of course, we have enough money that we don't really need to worry about a sale. We really don't. But that is okay. I think I'm going to let him maybe go to the store and stuff and get some plants so that he has some stuff to plant for his little garden. Uh, he did want to go jogging, so uh, we can do that. Uh, so we have science to level four. So many plants, so little time. He now understands enough to analyze plants. Uh, look in his inventory uh, for plants to analyze. Okay, so we can do that. We should let him clean his house. Come on. Go ahead and clean your house. Okay, so we got to go to work the next day to uh, to take care of that. Um, he's a bookworm, so he reads books fast. So we're get, we're just gonna clean up his house, and then uh, we will uh, we're going to uh, we're gonna go ahead and. Uh, I'm not sure what I have in there that was making that noise, but we got laundry to do. So I am not sure what we've got down over there that that is making that noise. I'll have to find out. It's kind of a funny noise. So we're going to do some laundry, looks like. We will take care of that. <laughs> and I guess he's going to come back and he's going to uh, clean up the newspapers. I'm not sure what I have here. Is it the toy machine that's making the noise? I wonder. Bet it might be. Take out the trash. All right. So we're going to take care of that. Yeah. What are we listening to? ignore this call. Ignore the call. Okay, so we have a compete in contest at the bookstore before time runs out. Earn some money and improve your logic skill. Okay, so let's see what we have here for opportunities. Um, come on. Okay, this is the bookstore. Ah! What are we going to practice here? Oh, we're going to practice some laser rhythmicon. Alright, why not? That'll give you some fun. Why not? Why not? Why not? Come on. 
actually we'll finish this up before we do laser rhythmicon. Yeah. So we got logic skill to level three. Okay. Come on. Yeah, I think it's that toy maker that's making the noise. Okay, so he wants to go jogging, so we're going to go ahead and let him do that. As soon as we get done. Okay. So... We want to get some more gardening under your belt, my friend. Now, let's see where we can take you jogging to. Let's see where we can take you jogging to. Let's see if there's any place that we can visit. Riddle away. Here's the bookstore. So we could come over here. We're going to jog here. Eh, if we can. We're going to jog here. You wanted to go jogging, so let's do it, my friend. Come on. And we're going to... Don't break a sweat. So we have athletic to level three. my friend. Let's have it. Okay, we got gardening to level two. know how fast they go when they jog. But I think we're going to find out. Oh, there's a little bird there. A little crow or something. I guess they don't go too fast when they jog. And there he is. All right, so let's see if we can maybe go to the bookstore. Ah, I know it's around here somewhere. Okay, let's go ahead and go into map view. Um, let's go ahead and go here, shop for some groceries. And then we'll do that, and then we will go ahead and... Uh, um, and then we'll go ahead and shop for some books while we're out. And then we'll go home. All right, so let's see what else that we can do for him since he has to analyze a plant.
All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and just pick out some, some uh, produce for him and uh, some books. I don't think you need me to shop for, I don't think you need to see the uh, groceries or the book shopping on camera. So I'm going to go ahead and take care of that. We'll get home and then uh, we'll continue a little bit more. Okay, guys, we are back. Now I went ahead and did all the groceries, did all the, or the produce, I mean, because we're going to plant some stuff and then we did all the books. So he did his jogging. So we are going to go ahead and ride home. So here we are. Now, I should see if we have any mail. I'm going to see if we have any mail. Oh, I might as well put away our university kit. <laughs> might as well take care of that. Come on. There we go. Come on. There we go. So, uh, we can go ahead and donate to a charity. We got the money. Let's go ahead and donate. We'll donate a thousand simoleons for that. And we'll donate to this one. Okay, nothing in the mail. There we go. So we'll get a nice little moodlet for that. We will get a nice little moodlet for that. And let's come out here and just... Um, plant some stuff. You know what? I, I better get a, I better get a sprinkler. Hold on one minute. All right, guys. So we're going to come out here and just have him plant a few things. I've already got it laid out. I did a couple of, uh, we got a lemon and an apple tree. We got some, uh, we got some herbs. Come on. Like some, uh, strawberries and, um, cocoa and, and so forth. So we're going to, we're going to turn on the sprinkler. We're going to go ahead and change you into your everyday outfit while we wait every day. Come on. And then let's play with the sprinkler <laughs> as soon as you're done planting. Ooh, you're dark. Yep. So that's got your fun and your water going. All right. So we got gardening to level three. He can now he can now fertilize um, his garden with vegetables and stuff. <laughs> so he's. <laughs> He's playing in the he's playing in the sprinkler. Come on. I'm going to get a screenshot of this. Uh, come on. Maybe. We'll get him just kind of playing in the in the sprinkler. That's funny. Try to get it a little bit closer so we can see. water getting him so <laughs> you should like that buddy <laughs> oh, he's laughing Jenshin, you're so funny. <laughs> Let's see what he's doing now. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 
I love it when they do that. It's so funny. <laughs> there we go. There's one. Uh, have to do this during the day, too. Okay, oh. leisure day is around the corner. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> I think they'll just keep ah. doing this forever until we tell them to stop. Oh. 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 <laughs> I think he will keep doing this forever until we tell him to stop. But let's see what else we have for him. Uh, let's see. Come on. All right, guys. Give me a minute. I'm stuck again. All right, guys. Uh, we're going to go ahead and have him stop with the sprinkler. And we're going to have him just uh, listen to some more gardening. And then we're going to get him to analyze a plant, which is what he wanted to do. I don't know. My game is just freezing a lot lately. Um, or, this, or, or for this session out. I don't know why. But it is freezing. It is freezing up on me, and I don't know why. So he's in his he's in his uh, swim trunks. But we're gonna go ahead and analyze a plant. Oh. Okay, we can go ahead and do this raspberry, and let's go ahead and just have him analyze it. That will help. So. Look at him go with all those little flowers behind him when, when he does all that. So, see what it says here. Not sure what that's going to do, but whatever works. So we're going to come back down here and let's do a, let's go ahead and try another horticulture experiment. Come on. See what I mean? It's, it's like, it's so slow. Um, horticulture experiment. We'll try that. And it's weird because, like, this town really isn't populated, and we just only got one sim in the household, so I don't get it. Somebody's stuck, I bet. Somebody is stuck, I betcha. So, it is what it's going to be. All right, let's go ahead and do a... Let's do a potato. What can go wrong with a potato, right? And once we do that, how about if we do a gene splicing experiment? Mm -hmm. Gene splicing experiment. see where we're going to go with this. Now he does have to go to work on uh, Tuesday. Read a book about science. Sculpt something worth 100 simoleons. Oh, it failed. He decreased the quality of the of that. Doggone it. All right, let's try this Kona bean seed. I'll have to get rid of that, uh, that bad quality. Come on. Come on. Bad quality potato seed, if I can find it. Hopefully I can find it. Sure. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ugh. See, this is so slow. Like, it's so weird. I do not get. 
get it. Oops. Okay, I want to try to find. I want to try to find this bad potato. I think. Oh, he's not having much luck with this. Okay, so left it unaltered. Uh, congratulations. Um, gardening to level four. Let's try this again. We'll try one. Try one more again. Gene splicing. Try it again. Yeah, he's not having much luck with this. He really isn't. Uh, how about a grape seed? Okay, vehicles removed. And then we could try another... We could try another uh, horticulture experiment. We'll try them again and see how we go. Let's hope that we get... Uh, he succeeded in his gene splicing experiment and changed the grape seed into the unknown rare seed. So we got oh. something unknown and oh. rare. Oh, 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 oh. All right. Very nifty. All right. Let's try a banana. See what we get from a banana. I want to get him another skill level if I can. Let's see what else he could do with this. But a radiation experiment, we'll try that when we're done. We'll try another gene splicing. Epic failure. Destroyed the banana. Oh. You're not getting a very good track record, my friend. Look at all that smoke. <laughs> okay. Ooh, I don't wanna I don't wanna do that. I don't wanna destroy my assassin bug. Let's try the Kona bean seed on the gene splicing. Herb experiment. We can do one of those. Ah. Hmm. But another gene splicing after that. Okay, we need another skill level, my friend. Oh, the carpool is going to come in about an hour. He succeeded in the gene splicing experiment and the cone of bean seed into the peppermint seed. Huh. Oh, gaboo! Okay, we'll get done with this and then we're going to get on to work. So, how about let's do a cinnamon. We're probably going to have to take a uh, invigorating elixir once we get home. Okay, buy a planter bowl, maybe later. Reach level six of science skill. We have science skill at level five. Um, 
correlate scientific data at the Science Research Station. I forgot what level we got to get to make a uh, forbidden fruit. I totally forget. Okay, success. The cinnamon seed uh, increased in quality to perfect. Oh. Hey, Dibby. awesome. Oh, Dibby Woo! We'll go to work in just a little bit as soon as we're done with your stuff. Come in. Okay, one more. Uh, how about a pecan seed? We'll try that. And then we'll go to work. Come on. We'll do one more and then we're going to go to work. And then I think that will be a good ending for this video. Hopefully he will be successful. Okay. Oh, he has, uh, oh, ca catastrophically failed the experiment. It looks like the pecan seed was also destroyed in the experiment. Drangza! Ugh. Well, I think you better quit for quit while you're ahead, buddy. Off to work you get. And this, I think, is going to be a good place for us to end. As I said, um, we're going to work. And after that failure. <laughs> All right, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to favorite and like. Leave a comment and tell me what you think. Hit that like button. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, go ahead and do that. Uh, you can also subscribe to my vlog channel, which is Sweet Nightingale 1973. That is in the description section of this video. Uh, so you guys have a great day, a uh, fantastic day, and <laughs> we'll talk to you all later. Bye, guys.